This team is so garbage. <laughs> oh my god. I don't think they're making it through. Okay, I'm calling it right now. Right now in the video. I'm calling it right now. I think they're going to lose. All right, folks. It's the end of the year. It's nice. It's cozy. It's nice. And um, I'm here at the end of the year for maybe the final video of the year to have a chill one and react to what is my favorite Nuzlocke content on YouTube. I'm always excited for this every single year, and I'm gonna and I'm gonna keep reacting to it every single year. Now you might be wondering, why am I recording in front of a green screen but didn't bother to key it out for this video? And to that I say, it's the holidays, give me a break, okay? It's Salty DK Dan's Friend Lock series, we're in season three, and I'm excited to give my pro Nuzlocke analysis to it to take this completely for fun project that everyone just does for the laugh and give my intelligent, thousands of hours of Nuzlocke experience analysis to it, so maybe you can learn something from it, I guess. But mostly to have a drink and have a good time. Uh, let's get into it! Season 3, friend luck, let's go! You know, I always get a little bit melancholic towards the end of the year. I start to reflect on the things that were constant in my life and the things that were changing. You know, it's always been a constant in my life and on this channel. This channel sponsored NordVPN. I've done so many ads for them at this point, I'm not even writing a script for this one. I can just do it off the top. If you want someone who's constant in your life too and who will always be there for you, the 24-7 customer support that NordVPN offers might be the right deal for you. The biggest use case I get out of Nord personally is expanding what content I have access to on my favorite streaming sites. A lot of things are geo-blocked, especially in Europe where I'm from. Shows come and go on streaming sites and being able to connect to the thousands of different servers in over 50 different countries just makes that access so much better for you. But there's also a lot of other real world applications that especially this year I've been able to use a lot. I've been traveling a lot this year and car rentals, flights, even hotel bookings. The prices on these dynamically change on a lot of factors, one of those factors actually being your location. So if you can connect to a different server and just make the website that you're booking from think that you're connecting from a different country, your price might drastically change. This actually works, I've done this. It's crazy how much the prices on flights and car rentals can change because of that. If you're not happy with Nord, there's always a 30 day money back guarantee. You can get a huge discount if you use my code Pokemon Challenges or go down to the link in the description. Thank you so much to Nord for sponsoring this video and a wonderful year of partnership. And thank you guys for watching the ad Let's get back into the video. Pokemon is a game designed for literal children. But what if we made it into hardcore furry roleplay? What? So yeah, today I'm doing a Nuzlocke of Pokemon Violet with a twist. All right, basically, listen, is, he's going to do a Nuzlocke, but his friend, every friend is going to control one Pokemon that he gets. Okay, we can, yeah. When they're in my party, yep. if they evolve True. any given challenge, so, we actually And I thought I was, I, I thought I had long intros. Their first appearance yep. And, it's true. It's like D&D, guys. Okay, let's go. Will my friends and I be able to become the champions like no one ever was? Or will we all die horrible, embarrassing deaths? This is the Pokemon Friendlock. The show that reminds us all that we don't have as many cool friends as Salty DK Dan. The babies! I'll ask you to choose which among these you'd like to have as your partner. He almost said Among Us. He almost said Among Us. It was so close. In Salty's defense, I think this was recorded right after the release of Scarlet Violet when Among Us jokes were still really funny. Who am I fucking kidding? They're still really funny. Scarlet Violet starter selection in this game. I, honestly, Spirigato is also really good. And Quaxley is not terrible by any means, but Fuukoko is so f broken. It's the best starter of all time in any Pokemon game. I think, did I, did I make a video about that? I don't remember. Maybe, or maybe that was an idea. And then, who, who knows? Torch Song is like the most broken move in any Nuzlocke ever created. This Pokemon is beyond busted. Um, if you pick this Pokemon in your Nuzlocke, you will solo basically the entire game with it. I love the limited performance in this game. It's so charming. We're not doing it. We're not starting this. Salty DK Dan fans when something is repeated more than once. <laughs> True. Salty, have you seen the rule 34 of the cat starter yet? Oh my lord, I've not it's seen that. Mm -hmm. I don't know what they're talking Jesus, about. I will say the rule 34 artists, especially for Pokemon, they're fucking quick with it, man. Like, god damn. It's like, I'll see like an announcement for like a new fucking Triceratops Ente on my Twitter timeline, and two nanoseconds later, Somebody's already drawn it, screwing a car. I always wanted to pick Quaxley because he's a little goober, and True. I like the way he looks. He's got All a right. little pompadour. Salty, can you rate my wee wee? Four. 
Anyway. Oh, yeah, is this how you guys feel when I pause the video to interrupt with some boring ass Nuzlocke analysis that nobody cares about? Would you like to go with our good water type Pokemon, Quaxly here? It'd be so funny if I said right. no and then immediately changed. This is the worst starter, but it's still really, really, really good. Pump, pump. Though, so of course, no grand adventure would be complete without a little bit of unnecessary character lore that adds almost nothing to the plot whatsoever. Thank God, That's Lark so came exciting. in packing. I never met my father. Aww. I was born in daycare. Do you know anything about him at all, or do you know anything about your parents? I think he was purple and weirdly, like, amorphous. I, I gotta yeah, be honest, funny. my first thought wasn't Ditto, it was Grimer. Oh! Um... <laughs> uh, no, I, was, I, I... was like, interesting lineage, um... <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I actually, the truth is, it's not Grimer. My father was Grimace, from McDonald. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, buddy, hey, buddy, oh. <sighs> You donated $400 to say sandwich?! Oh, well, come on, come on, let me get, let me get, just like... To be fair, I've never gotten a large Twitch donation where the message attached to the donation was anything insightful. Never. The people, the, the big spenders are always the one smoking the most crack. Oh, wait, I'm supposed to be talking about this Nuzlocke, right? Yeah. Uh, um, Oink, wait, what is this Pokemon called again? Lechonk. Lechonk. Uh, great. Uh, pretty good. Pretty good special defense bulk, actually. Um, and normal types with normal stab are just... Always pretty fucking good. Uh, it's it's gonna get outscaled really quick, but for early game, this thing's pretty great. I'm Lark. I'm a duck. Hi. We're so committed to roleplay this season. I love it. By far my favorite part. Look at it! Oh my god! <laughs> that is so unfortunate. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, penis man, where are you taking me? My name's Lark. No, no, not you. Oh. The, the, <laughs> Why did that like get me? Fuck. Far more <laughs> Hi. Hi. I have never used this Pokemon and never seen it used in a... Oh, wait, no, I have seen this used. I think this thing goes off on the Elite Four, actually. This is a really good encounter. It's probably not very good early, huh? He has, however, eaten a lot of light bulbs and drinks gasoline like a champ. Based. Well, since you've already for forcibly assigned me a name, I had another one given to me, handed down by generations. I'm, I'm force-kinning you. Did he say he's force-kinning him? What the fuck is happening? What? All right, we're making good moves. Or wait, we get oh, no! right. This video has some pump in it. Is it late enough for the video far enough away from the spot that I can start drinking this? Who the fuck knows? She turned him into a light bulb. Tasty's moment has come. Mud shot. That's right. All right, good move. Yeah. Probably should use that first, but it's okay. To, uh, some guns. Yeah. I'm gonna lower the speed Tesla first so you can get speed of you. Speed control very important in your Nuzlocke. You might Here, be able to outspeed the turn PC, after. Like, is but who's ever lost in Nimona? Let's be real. Upon entering Uvula Academy, we finally reached the single best part of any modern Pokemon game, wherein your controller becomes a glorified page turner. Hell yeah. Yep, hour long, unskippable exposition time. Peppy, it's Peppy, I know that you were really excited right. about playing the video game, but we have to talk about more lore. No. Anyway, have you heard more about Paldea as a region? Let me explain I'm for the next hour. To put a gun in my mouth. <laughs> oh, dude, these games suck so fucking hard, man. Is so. Didn't we have to? When we nuzlocke this game, didn't we have like a save state after the fucking school <laughs> to reset to when we lost? Oh my god. I oh read about God. these guys online. They're weird. Small live. Dude, this game has so many like really good usable Pokemon. I will say that a lot of the new mons are like quite strong. And I think this isn't even an exception. This thing is like quite decent. But like grass types just get like really good moves nowadays, so. So just real quick, why does it feel like you guys have been stuck talking to people for the past <clears throat> hour and a half? Because we've um, been doing it for four years. Yeah, I can kind of Four years. Yep. Yeah, a lot of time has passed. We went to school. What'd yep. you major in? Pokemon anthropology. That's some nerd stuff. Okay, thanks. Anyway, my name's Joe. What's up? This is me when I tell people at the function that I. <laughs> I'm a, dude, it's so funny. I go to like a lot of raves and like uh, techno parties and shit because I'm middle European and I'm just legally required to. And it's it's always the same conversation when I meet someone at one of these parties. 
And it's like, well, it's on the dance floor. So it's like, you have to imagine this like being yelled really loud and everything's repeated like three times. So they asked me like, what do I do? And I'm like, oh, I'm a YouTuber. And then uh, they're like, oh, that's so sick. What do you do? And I'm like, yeah, I do gaming content. I do Pokemon. And then they make that face and they go, oh, cool. And then I try to shift the conversation to what they do. Uh, it's, it's a very predictable conversation every time. Okay, here, this thing. Oh, oh my god. What is this it? thing is fucking what? broken. Oh, oh my it's god. It's salt rock thing, yeah. This it's is so strong. It's like the first I mean, really, really useful like what defensive opinion? rock type they ever put in any of the main series games. This thing is crazy strong. Just ridiculous like baseline stats, right? Just really, really, really huge stat check. Um, really, really good access to utility moves. Did you just pick up that berry? Yeah, that's right. I don't have any fucking hands. I used my own little hole. I'll let you figure out which one. <laughs> Everyone hates to see a girl boss like me winning. You want to, you want evolve? to evolve? You should, you should, you should. Oh, yeah! My okay, baby boy is growing it. up you'll, you'll for Lark to get yeah. bigger. Send me to college. Oh, what I feel. Oh, I'm also, I'm putting a, I'm putting out a thing. For the next friend lock season, you can quote me on this. If you're a part of the D the salty DK Dan friend lock group, every single person who during the next friend lock refuses their evolution of their Pokemon will get a fifty dollars from me straight up. You can DM me; I'll, I'll PayPal it fifty bucks for everyone that refuses the evolution throughout the entire run. That's that's my bounty for you. Don't use wing oh, attack. He's coveting me. He's coveting me. Oh, okay, oh okay. Okay, okay. Wait, no, I need to that's... heal Lark first. Yeah. Oh, that's... Oh, that's actually <laughs> really spooky. <laughs> oh, shit. We're a little bit in trouble here. I, I wouldn't have thought about Anger Point at all at that point, to be honest. Yeah, people attack the Pokemon that they... That they try to catch in Nuzlocke too much. For the most part, you have, like, no excuse to not have, like, a fuck ton of balls in your inventory, right? And like most of these low level Pokemon, if you just chuck like 10 balls, even at full HP at them, they're probably going to get caught, especially like a Mankey. So I, I'm just like in the mode of like pretty much never attacking, especially at low levels. At higher levels, when catch rate gets higher, you know, you try to have like something with a par paralysis move or a sleep move or something on your team. And you usually have like one or two moves that you know are just like not going to knock something out. You got your like seismic tosses or your, uh, your, your uh, sonic booms or whatever, right? There's just like certain Pokemon that are like really good at catching other Pokemon. There's like Noctowl is like really infamous for this in Nuzlocking, right? Where it's got like Hypnosis and Nightshade and it's pretty bulky. Like that that's like mid late game shit for like early game. My advice is generally like just have a lot of balls and like don't attack the Pokemon you're trying to catch. Unless they're like infam they have like infamously bad catch rates, like baby Pokemon. Or there's some situations where it's like Obviously, it can, like, start to kill you, so you don't have, like, infinite current turns to actually kill it. Speaking of uh, being killed by a wild Pokemon, let's see this uh, plus six attack Mankey wreck through this team. No, I need to heal Lark first. Yeah, definitely. Calm down. Everyone calm down. This is going to do so much damage. I think you can get one shot by this, no? Yeah. What the f- Yeah, you just get one shot here, I think. He needs, like, a four hit. Yeah, one more. Yep. Anger point is plus six. Jesus this feels... Christ! It's we're one stream in! Oh, they're actually fucked. Because all these Pokemon are quite slow. So I don't know if you can even run here. Um the your chance of running is based on your Pokemon's speed. Unmodified speed, right? So not taking account like paralysis or speed drops or whatever. If you're faster than the uh, opposing wild Pokemon, you will always run. And then um, the rest of the calculation only starts when you're like slower, and then it's kind of based on your speed. So I don't know. I don't think any of these are gonna be faster than Mankey. So we have to get lucky to even get out of this alive. This might like wipe the run. This has never happened to me. This is such a rare situation that you crit an anger point Pokemon that you're trying to catch. This thing was also obviously really high level. This is a super like niche situation. It's actually really interesting. It was just his birthday. He just got to 16. He just got his driver's license. He just got his driver's license. Oh my. Fun fact, uh, Germans don't start driving when they're 16. You can get like a learner's permit at 17, drive with like your parents, and then at 18 get your actual license. But you can start drinking beer and wine at 16. Isn't that crazy? It's burn the fastest. R.I.P. Come on. It's in- well, actually, this is- going for the Great Ball here, I think is actually a super good play. It probably is. This is really low HP. 
No, this is this is the play. Holy shit, yeah. Okay, please, please, please. Oh. Nice. Well played. Oh yes, okay. Super well played. Jesus Christ. I'm a oh my god. You killed our best friend who was Pompadour. Oh, this is great character it development. You killed him birthday. on his birthday. On his these birthday. These hands, these sexy, sexy hands. What? Look at me, funny monkey. What's your name? Watch me spin a plate on, its, on a stick. Woo! <laughs> Mikey the Mankey. And this is Mikey, um, who, by the way, I think, so I asked Salty DK Dan before I recorded this video, uh, if I if I didn't know anything, right, um, uh, before going in, and he just said that uh, his friend Mikey wanted a shout-out, um, I'm assuming is the Mikey who this Mankey is named after, um, and uh, I don't do shout-outs, so go fuck yourself, Mikey. And who was pop adorable, <laughs> and it was his birthday. Um, it was you his killed him birthday. on his birthday. On his these birthday. hands, these you. sexy, sexy hands. <laughs> Mike is really funny, though. As you can probably imagine, the next hour or two devolved into pure chaos and hatred. Second season, Lark died and it's so early. It's not my fault. I'm so sexy. You know, Nuzlocke stuff. But at the end of the day, <laughs> that is I wasn't Nuzlocke mad stuff. That's exactly what happens. I think I was more mad at the fact that I didn't know how the ability anger point worked and blamed Mikey as a scapegoat. When the Mankey was hit by a critical hit from Lark, the ability yep. anger point had activated. Yeah, we get all that. This fully maximizes its attack stat yep. as a sort of last ditch effort for survival. Nope, that... And since Mankey is also a physical attacker, yep. this no, meant that it got crazy available, powerful, it, yeah, crazy was aware fast, of all that. and it went completely over my head. <laughs> I have a really bad habit of not paying attention to stat changes which can also be said for everybody else on the team and that was that is, kind of that is very self-reflective that's a good call out you know if you see if you see a pattern like that in your own nose locks um if you see yourself dying to something over and over again uh seeing a pattern like that is like the first and like 90 percent to like fixing him becoming a better player so i mean it doesn't fucking matter for salty because like he uh, his decisions matter, but like not that much. Is <laughs> right. <laughs> so, it doesn't matter. I, like I could be in in Salty's position and probably end up the same way. I just for all we know, Salty DK bet Dan might be the best Nuzlocker in the world. Decided to heal Lark instead of running. Mm. It was already over. I mean, you went At one for point, one. You got to make you for it. Overall, Anni Annihilate, by the way, I didn't get to talk about this yet. Is a fucking fantastic encounter. So so strong. Um. I would say worth more than Quacovel, so uh, yeah, it's good trade actually. I'm, I think everything was done right here. We had lost. Oh yeah, but these are were attached to these characters, so we were supposed to be like, oh no, they, they died, right? Because we're not the 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 heartless Nuzlocker anymore. That yeah, that's because of the remember the run and bun video guys where I was like, oh, I'm like, wow, this, this, I'm like attached to my Pokemon now. It's the blah 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 something. Yeah, that's that's the new arc. Okay, yeah. Fuck, I was really attached to this fucking duck. And at that point, we thought it couldn't get any worse until it totally did. <laughs> After Lark died, we realized that we wanted to grind up the team level-wise okay. to fight the gym. Why is the recording? Why is the... Okay, OBS is frozen. I don't know if it... Uh-oh. Oh no. Yo, uh, it's me. It's Jan's Pokemon Challenges. Listen, I just lost... I, I just lost 30 minutes of recording. Uh, doing this reaction. Um, so instead of faking my uh, reaction to it again and just recording everything again, I'm going to give you a quick rundown of everything that happened while I did that and then all my insightful and funny things that I had to say to that. Alright, so basically what happens, guys, um, they run into this really powerful trainer who uh, almost, like, almost wipes their team. And then they realize you can run from trainer battles in this game, right? Which makes sense because it's open world and they're all over, like, sometimes you just run into a high level trainer you can't beat, so running is just a good option. And they were like, oh, we're just going to run from this, uh, but we're only going to use it once because we're really fair and Nuzlocke's and I was like and I was like then during the recording I was doing my whole thing of like oh it's your Nuzlocke your rules whatever is the most fun for you is the thing that you should do you know which is good that's that's what you should be doing but um turns out uh they actually said they committed and said uh, they wouldn't run uh, again from a trainer battle they ran from one more trainer battle after that but they were like no now we promise it's we're not gonna run again because it's not in the spirit of the game which you know that's fair that's cool that's fun just being through this first gym in this game the gym leaders in this game are especially early piss easy you can cheese this with like every single pokemon in the game basically so um, nothing to go over there. A Next up, we encounter a, uh, a Squawkabilly, which is pretty bad, and then a Taurus, which is a really, really good early game. So I did the whole thing of like, oh yeah, this one's not, not great. I've never seen Squawkabilly any do anything, but like Taurus is really good. Uh, that's obviously, I don't have to tell you about how that's a good early game Pokemon. 
Next up, we have this whole sequence of like catching uh, Tandem Mouse, and I was like, "Oh, this is such a cool Pokemon!" And the person voicing the Tandem Mouse doing such a good job, blah blah blah. It was really cute. Okay, moving on. Um, and then I went on this whole rant about how Tarantula is like the worst Pokemon in the game from a Nuzlocke perspective. This thing's horrible. It does nothing. Again, like you can like sack this on one fight and then move on. Next up, Palma. Uh, yeah, great Pokemon. And then we had for some reason after this, uh, we had the funeral for this duck thing, and that was really funny. Um. I All right, I can can no put Mikey that. away. Mikey's not allowed to talk. I remember that. Cause Mikey gave a eulogy. Cause he killed you. You get it? Cause the the main key killed the. It was really funny. Anyway, uh, moving on. Uh, we have the claw fight and the uh, the guy who who's playing the Tauros decided to start attacking the shelter, which was really funny. But they didn't get punished because this fight is also really easy because this game is made for babies. Then we had uh, then we had Salty DK Dan telling us about even how how easy these gym fights first gym fights are with something that makes a lot of sense is that they have like a mix up Pokemon in the back with a different type, but then they terrestrialize into the same type, and you can just use the same strategy to sweep through the game. Um, yeah, and uh, then we had discussion about if, whether the pseudo widow is made of felt or of poop, and I think it's made of felt for sure. And then we caught a uh, Wigglet. <laughs> <laughs> which is all, probably also in contention for one of the worst new Pokemon in this game. Um, this is this thing's terrible. It doesn't do anything throughout the entire game. So um, next up, there was an Iono fight, and I went on this whole rant about how like Iono is what Nuzlockers call a box check. Uh, we Nuzlockers really like like making up new gaming terms and throwing them around. It's really important to us to make us feel like we're real gamers and not just not just people playing a children's game. There are certain boss fights. There are certain gym leaders in certain Nuzlocks whose whose difficulty is entirely dependent on which Pokemon you catch. Um, so uh, the classic example of this is Flannery in Emerald Kaizo. Uh, Flannery is basically like, there's like four or five encounters that are really, really good for Flannery. If you get those, the fight is like really doable. It's still hard, but it's doable. And if you don't get any of those encounters, it's the hardest fight in the game. Similarly, I think Iono is like a little bit mini box check in this game. I've seen runs end to this, including, I think one of my soul links, um, with Alpha Red, he lost there. Because uh, he sucks. There's a lot of Pokemon that take Iono for a ride in this game, and uh, they got like a lot of them. But sometimes you get none of them, and then you actually can kind of struggle with this fight. That is actually. Um, and then, oh, it's really fun doing this reaction because this moment happens, right? Oh, oh wait, that means I can use. Look, he's much on it now. Wow, that is actually. Because this moment happened, and I didn't understand what Hannah was saying. Uh, I couldn't understand her, and I thought, oh, wait, this is a throw. This thing has levitate. Why are you mud-shotting? Not realizing that it had smackdown, because I'm washed, apparently. Uh, and then moving on, what else happened? Oh, this guy. I went on this rant how it's really stupid that every single one of these guys... Because the first time I saw one of these cars, I was like, oh, shit, that's really cool. Uh, that this guy, that this trainer's thing is that he has, like, a car. That he has, I wonder what the other is going to have. And then they all had a fucking car. Then we catch Bramblin, and I talk about how Bramblin's, like, an actually decent encounter, but really hard to use so it's probably not going to get used effectively at all um they get introduced this thing evolves and they're like which one's given the best head and i was given a whole thing about like if you stand on the with your legs on the front two ones and then lean back to the back one the back one can actually give you the best is this does this illustration make it is editor zoom in on this is this so this is basically what you'd be doing right that's why i think the back one gives head but let me know in the comments which one which one of these do you think gives the best oral sex. We do this, we be this guy, then we catch Flittle, and I talk about how this game has so many broken setup sweepers and how many like good Pokemon are in this game and how easy this game is. Uh, Flittle is so, 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 so strong in this game. One of the best. It's it's a really, really, really strong Pokemon. It's, it's one of those setup sweepers where it's, if you're using it correctly, it makes the game so, so easy. And I think this is where the recording crashed. Oh no, this is not, that after the, it, it, it crashed after this. I was also talking about how Cyclozar is maybe the most, after like Skeletors, the most broken Pokemon in this game because Whatever that move is called, uh, the 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 one the tail move, the fucking uh, I knew it when I was recording earlier. How do I not know it anymore? The the one you know the the one the tail move where you substitute and you get a switch, you get a free switch out of it. This Pokemon is beyond busted, especially with all the broken setup sweepers in this game and terrestrialize and stuff. It's just crazy. But I will say another Pokemon that does take a lot of skill to use, and in this friend lock format, cohesive strategies that take a lot to do, that take coordination and um, some planning are all not worth anything. So all things considered, it's probably not gonna matter that this Flittle and the Cycles are, are broken beyond belief, so yeah. After catching our next couple of new Pokemon, we decided that it was time to start our quest for the fourth gym, led of course by Kofu, the water type trainer. So far, the puzzles for these have been pretty easy to deal with overall, so given that we're halfway through the gym challenge, I'm sure that this next one will be a pretty difficult task if we're gonna fight his wallet. You, you just, you, you just gotta return him his wallet that he dropped oh, before yeah, that he was really left stupid, town. Huh? That's it. That's the challenge. Pokemon. 
Oh wait, I can I can get a snack. Why does that make me laugh? This is why this is why this is my favorite Nuzlocke series on the internet. It's because for some fucking reason, either Salty DK Dan or his editor or both or as, as someone else involved with this production knows that saying that's Pokemon and then flashing the Digimon logo on screen is funny to me. Move out of the way now or I will kill you. Lemonade. 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 Why did they make an involved Lemonade. animation for that? <laughs> that is the most... Lemonade. That is the most... Lemonade. What, there's Lemonade. another shot? Hey dude, uh, you've been at the vending machine a little while there. Uh, do, uh, this do this is the this is the gonna, the gonna most be. involved animation they've done for this video so far. Why did they do it for this uh, moment? What the fuck is going on? So what's stronger between my grass moves? Depends on how lucky you are. Oh, I feel lucky. It doesn't actually, because bullet seed hits minimum twice, so it's always more damage. I'm I'm dude. How did I build my entire career on being the fucking nerd emoji? I don't whatever. Um, I'm pretty sure that Bramble Gas sweeps this fight, uh, right? Jay Weed sweep. Even with Bullet Seed, like you just terror. Oh, yeah. Just fucking kill everything. It's just it's met up because I know that a lot of bullshit is about to happen in this run because I was told so by Salty. Um, and I'm just very excited to see them fuck up. But it's just like I'm I'm I keep wondering where. But then again, this game is so piss easy. That probably what happens is the players, the friends, the Pokemon start fucking around more and more and more and more because they saw how easy the game was and eventually got too much and they screwed them over. That's probably because at some point during a lot of the ways that these Pokemon fights and Nuzlocke's happen is like you're super fine. Like you're either super, super fine. You're super fine. And then like two or three, maybe one or two mistakes will like immediately shift the battle and you realize like wait i'm actually in a lot of trouble right now and i need a lot of luck to get out of the situation and then you sometimes just lose there are a lot of people saying this motherfucker's got some ice moves i'll switch out <laughs> do we want to believe chat this time uh do you guys want the answer well, well it's crab dominable so i would assume that it would have ice type moves yeah fair yeah, that's right good Bet assumption you better run doesn't have any ice type moves well, fuck, I just switched out for no reason. Oh no, he's got a hammer. <laughs> Made of crap! You can do a lot of damage. I mean, you're fine. Oh. Even the sandstorm. Maybe I shouldn't have been in there. Oh, oh my god! Oh my goodness! Oh, oh my god! <gasps> Jayweed, you got this, man. Look at me. That I'm not at full health. I don't feel very confident. You know who is? Mikey. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> you couldn't wait for the sandstorm to kill it. <laughs> no. <laughs> That's it not out. gonna work. What if Jay it's why is the Bramble Gas tail holding a Carbos? <laughs> What's going on? Let's actually do some quick analysis. Like, actually. Um, this is not a guaranteed crab hammer, right? Because the Palmot is at really low HP, so probably all of Crabronable's damaging moves kill it right now. So we'll go for one of them at random. AI always goes for a kill, but if it sees a kill with multiple moves, it picks a random one. So this is probably the least safe switch you can make uh, if you want to get Bramble Gas into this. What you could do, um, this is why like normal types are like often very, very good, is they just don't have a lot of weaknesses, so they can like tank any random move. You can go to Oink alone, right? Tank the random move. And then you're like, because you're pretty healthy, you're then guaranteeing the the crab hammer because that's going to be the the most powerful move. And then you can go to J Weed. <laughs> oh, please don't. Let's see if they got him lucky. Okay, oh, it worked shit. out. Come on. Oh, come on, Jay. Tough it out for us, bud. But that's still a lot of damage from crab hammer. Oh, you're going to heal me. You got this. You're going Jay. to heal me right now, buddy. Yeah. God. Okay, that wasn't that bad. So yeah, obviously Salty's also playing with potions. Um, so a lot of my backseating and a lot of my advice, a lot of my analysis for this video is going to be basically like, oh, he should have like spammed potions here until the AI was out of PP, <laughs> which is, that's why using items is so stupid because that's, but like in a, in a format like this where it, like, uh, the Pokemon can kind of do whatever they want uh, that you kind of need the potions to tide you over. Right. So yeah, I would just heal this until this like misses a crab hammer and then you can start attacking because crab hammer doesn't have perfect accuracy. Just, just terastalize and like mega drain. Don't you have mega drain? Oh yeah, I still have Mega Drain. And you do still have Terrastalization. Oh. Let's do that. Oh Terrastalize, Mega Drain. I like it. First. 
I actually like it a lot. Really good play. That's probably the best play there, yeah. You didn't even need his spam potions. good stuff. Hashtag J sweep. I don't even think you're dead to crit, right? Nice. Well played. Oh my god. Like I got hit with a hammer, but no, I'm a crab hammer. It was made out of crabs, yeah, yeah. Oh, I love this game so much. What just happened? It's so good. Did everyone freaking out? That's so sick. Since we had no sort of clause in the rules for something like the game crashing on us because we didn't expect that to happen, we very much did have to fight Kofu all over again. This man, this man is surprisingly dangerous. Okay, Salty is a much more dedicated Nuzlocker than me. I've had this happen to me a lot. And uh, legal console, playing on legal console issues, you know, safe state issues, corrupted save states, uh, me just fucking up a recording and having to go, like, me, me just fucking up a safe state, having to go back uh, on stream and stuff. And obviously this game crashing a lot. Uh, I always just play back up to the point that I was at and uh, disregard Nuzlocke rules until I get back to that point. That's how you should do it. But this is better content and anything to make this game harder, right? <laughs> hey, spoiler alert, he beats him again. this time, you're going to stay a loser. Kofu's just like, well, I didn't want to do this. And then all of a sudden you see a bunch of IP addresses in chat. <laughs> <laughs> just IP, my IP address flashes on the screen. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. <laughs> no. <laughs> Dude, oh, what's with that every single time <laughs> I watch a new playthrough of this game, I see a new glitch. It's crazy. It's crazy. Oh, okay, there's just a dolphin now. All right. Okay. The classic friendlock dolphin, our mascot. What is that? What, this is what is so happening? Chaotic. We're going to the normal type gym, so I'm swapping out my party. Bye guys, I hope that you enjoyed Lemonade Mouth. I put it on the TV in the box. Lemonade Mouth is playing 24-7. What? <laughs> <laughs> um, four badges, only one death so far. Nice. Uh, I've, I, I think I, I said this in the part where the recording got messed up. Salty is playing very deliberately, very carefully. Uh, he's grinding a lot, he's playing slow. He's making sure he's always like um, planning everything out. He's, a, he's doing great. The only one who can screw him over is his friends. Now at this point, you may be wondering, why are they back in the starting area of the game beating up a bunch of low-level Pokemon? Is it because it helps boost their ego and overall self-esteem? Well, yeah. Yeah, it does. But it's also because we're doing some careful planning and prep work for future fights. You see, nice. starting in this generation, like I mentioned a while ago now, Mikey's Primeape can evolve into a special third form called Annihilate. To initiate the evolution in the first place, though, we had to have Mikey use the move Rage Fist 20 different times. And we figured that the easiest way to go about this was to just go to an earlier area of the game and just spam it for a couple of minutes. That way, yep. along the road to his evolution, he has zero risk of death whatsoever. I'm going to use this opportunity real quick to hijack this video to talk about a point because I made the short about rare candies and then there was the whole Verlis and then Verlis Fine and then people on Twitter were talking about it and stuff. Whenever I bring up rare candies to skip grinding in Nuzlocke, the most common point I see as a response to that is, yeah, but grinding is part of the game because you could lose Pokemon to grinding. And that's true. I think, like, when, when people talk to me about this, they forget that I, for four years on stream, I played without rare candies. I've been through, I've, I've grinded more than maybe anyone ever has nuzlocking ever. I'm, it's, I'm not exaggerating. Because when, I, when my channel blew up, I was already using rare candies, right? Maybe the two are connected, who knows? I think I might have done more grinding for nuzlocks than anyone else, at least, like, who streamed on the internet. What grinding strategies in Nuzlocke devolve to, if you don't use rare candies, is because you don't want to lose Pokemon while grinding, you just go back to the lowest level area as possible. We did this on Emulator, it, like, in, like when we first played Crystal Kaizo before it became Crystal Kaizo Plus. We would go to an area with low level Pokemon and set the emulator to auto fire on A and then just run around and kill level 5 Pokemon with no risk of ever losing a Pokemon, right? Or... You could just, and we did this in Emerald Kaiser before we used candies, you can just put your Pokemon in the daycare and run back and forth. And then you'll never lose a Pokemon. 
I don't understand that argument, or I do understand where it's coming from, but as you optimize your nuzlocks, you discover these strategies that are low risk for grinding. So because you because grinding is normally risky, you're then incentivized to do the grinding that's even slower to not have that risk anymore. And at that point, why not just use candies? The requirements, all we had to do now was properly level him up to start his transformation. This would have been a very easy task. I had a bunch of experience. Or if you want a really quick response, if you see that argument online, if you want a quippy, easy response to that, that kind of dunks on people, what you can also say is losing Pokemon to grinding is part of the game if you suck at grinding. However, and don't shoot me for this, since we were just about to fight the fifth gym leader who uses normal types, I thought it would be fitting if we leveled him up during that upcoming challenge instead of prior. Because otherwise, okay. I was kind of worried that we'd be a little bit over leveled for the upcoming challenge and yeah. it wouldn't really be, you know, a challenge. Okay. Basically, I didn't want to be crazy over leveled just in case the YouTube comments called me out on it. Uh, be because because they do that sometimes. Oh, that's a pretty hefty mon right there. Never mind. See, this is why I didn't want to do the, the gym challenge and just skip to the leader. Why not? What's the problem? <laughs> Let me evolve. You can evolve, evolve in the fight. No. <laughs> <laughs> We're still technically doing Nuzlocke rules. Drain punch you. After this, I'm going back in. Okay, let's go back in. Let's see. I was about to say, well, no, I don't get credit for this. I can't say I was about to say, because I wasn't sure, so I didn't say it. But yeah, Greedent does get counter. <laughs> I don't remember ever seeing this specific Greedent use counter, though. I'm hungry. This is oh quite my unfortunate. Oh god! <laughs> oh no. Maybe we should have gone into the yeah, gym. Yeah, I mean, we should have gone in. No? Oh yeah, oh yeah, guys. Maybe we should have gone into the gym. Maybe we should have ordered the Fortnite pasta, huh? <laughs> so does he evolve now? <laughs> Can I be real? I'm actually really angry about this. Look at this. Lock has been Dude, like Salty is been so good pissed. With a lot of the game coming up too. And we just, and yeah, we, we probably would have been really good. Hour of this yeah, game. guys, it's almost as if we did the gym leader. Derek, you don't understand. This is amazing content for later. It's, no, it's not for me. It's not for me. I don't like this content. This is shit. This is bullshit. Like, uh, I, I swear to God, half of the Pokemon in this game sweep like half the gym leaders in this game on their own. But I'm not sure. This this fight can get out of control if you're not careful. Let's let's see what happens. Chat, I'm 100. I mean, you're you right using now. workup. You're no using jokes. setup sweep. It's probably I'm fine. I'm so angry. This should be the last one. Yeah, this is the final one. Kill that fucking bird. Let's hell by one shot. Yeah, never mind. Yeah, you okay. good. Oh, yeah, you did. Good job, Brady. Probably... I'm just gonna say this before the battle starts. If anything happens, I do apologize. I accepted my fate a while ago, and this is a pretty fun okay. little fight right here. Peppy, I don't... Peppy, I'm supposed to be the scary one. I don't like this energy. The two deaths of the season so far are so fucking uneventful. One was a random encounter, and the other one was just a child. One was Mikey, and another one was Mikey being killed by a child. I don't agree. I thought those are, those are fan... Well, okay. The second one was... <laughs> That's a very, like, you, losing something to counter is probably the most classic way of losing something in a Nuzlocke that's normally easy. But losing something to a wild Pokemon anger point is very unique. It's the first time I've seen anything like that. This is not a great setup versus Skeleturge. I mean, you probably have to go Cyclozar, right? And just start using, like, Breaking Swipe. And it doesn't really matter because it's going to use special attacks. I guess you just Dragon Claw. He's Terra Normal, though. <laughs> Terras Does this thing terrestrialize? So well, now it's terrestrializing. <laughs> yeah, into this is fire. Into really fire scary, type, actually. Which does, which makes him lose the weakness I was doing. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, do oh, you no, have any last words? She's smart. Am I, I don't think I'm gonna. I'm same level. I don't think I'm gonna die to this. That's what we thought about. Mike. Just in case. Famous last words. Yeah, oh, Skeletor yeah, is super bulky. Uh, uh, yeah, and now oh, it's it starts setting out. This is super attack. scary. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna start digging a hole. Don't, don't, don't bother. Uh, I would like to not be here. I would like to leave. Who? 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 Can you shed tail here? Who? This is, this is a murder. That's spooky. Dude, who? Whoever is coming this in is real going spooky. to die. There's no choice. Oh, we have to, we have to sack. Okay, let's actually do the analysis. Because I'm not super sure how shed tail works in this situation. Because um, I played this game once, beat it, and then never touched it again. But 
Assuming you don't Chateau, which you might. I mean, it's just sack the weakest, go to the strongest, right? I don't know the move sets here, but Bramble Gas is also not great at this point, to be honest. Yeah, I would sack Bramble Gas here and then go like Tauros. Ooh, ooh, ooh. This is this is a murder. Ooh. Whoever is coming in is going to die. There's no choice. We have to we have to sack somebody. Eric, throw me yep. in. I'm not using yeah. I'm not using Shedtail. I believe in Mel. I've accepted. Oh, he said he's not using Shedtail again. Somebody. What are Thanks we gonna do everything. after we heal? I don't know. I don't know. I welcome you to the league. This is going to plus two now. now. I'm out. Oh. Ah. Oh my ah, god. No. Yeah, you wow. just lose. We're going to die. Yeah, this, this is really is scary. Gonna be this is honestly the biggest reason to not pick Quaxley in this run. Because <laughs> you're giving Nimona the best Pokemon in the game. If <laughs> you're I just dead. It, it was great being a family with you all. <laughs> Super Fang, please. Don't We're make me Christmas. cry, you little creepy thing. Uh-oh. <sighs> Can you put enough damage down to kill this? Oh my God. It is at least pretty this slow. <gasps> I love friendship mechanics so much. The power of my bestie will help me live! I think Hyper Voice kills, maybe? Look, some people in the chat were mad that I have a very Okay. Demeanor. Let's change that. I have a very unpopular take among Nuzlockers about this. I think the the friendship mechanics are super hype. <laughs> Just having a random chance to live something on one on like one HP is insane content. Let's fucking go, Hyper Voice. I think this might kill. Scream, family, scream! No, 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 no. it's not even close. Oh, no. Never mind. I forgot. I forgot. I forgot. Oh, Tandemass yeah, fucking sucks shit. Let's I forgot. This is the most overrated Pokemon Brady maybe of all time. Everyone was overhyping this thing so much. For this is you, Brady, because you're probably faster. Uh, I am. Faster. You can still win. Let's raging bull. You don't wipe here. Yeah, you're just faster. Just kill this fucker. Please. Yes. Okay. Yes. Oh nice. my yes. god. Oh my god. What is this man? <laughs> this is so stupid. Dude, his editors got a. They got everything. <laughs> it's not even from this run! Such a sick a Pokemon. Guy. Say hi with guaranteed, guaranteed catch. Also, not terrible in this game either. Yes. Oh, this thing can like do stuff. Thank you. Not a lot, but it can do stuff. For S the Toad School. I do not know what this thing is, and I don't think I want to. The feet. <laughs> All I know for sure is that one of their legs is definitely not a leg. What's going on? This is so sick. Hey, Joe. Hey, Joe. I can't breathe. <gasps> Oh, this is destined. This is perfect. We this need these. Good. I just, every time I watch a playthrough of this game, I'm reminded how many broken Pokemon are in Scarlet and Violet. It's so crazy. This thing is also so strong. This is. Uh, isn't the trainer supposed to name Pokemon? <laughs> I love this one. All right. <laughs> oh, his ass. Yeah, you had the chance to, but. <laughs> Lord. Oh, no. Oh, it's Oh, it's my. Oh, Blorpo. It's from my shows. Yeah, Wait. sure, I'm Blorpo. Do you perchance uh, moderate any Blorpo. subreddit? <laughs> on reddit.com are you talking to me <laughs> no this is a great character Boydo, the tinkatoff epic oh. rap battles of history right versus bill gates <laughs> what is that my name is <laughs> bill gates and i'm bill gates i'm a specter from which there's no protector and victory onto me you will render when the crowd sees you a mere pretender is he sleeping? Is he fucking sleeping? <laughs> that's yeah, so disrespectful. Uh, Wait, actually, good tryout. That strategy that we talked. You know. Okay. Oh, the classic strategy. Yeah. What are you guys you, talking about? Wait. So we actually did a lot of planning okay. before this. Let's hear it. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna win this battle. Really, you do something a little unique. So I'm gonna bite. Uh huh. Okay. A J. What? What? Trust me, it worked. He's got this. He's, okay. he's like, you know, around Mikey, 
had that ability that would like make him stronger if he took damage. We actually both took his body and ate a little bit of it, and it made we got that ability. Don't worry, trust me. I will okay. blow it seed, Gerber. Uh, <laughs> they're just throwing. So for a second, I thought he just didn't know how Wind Rider worked, but it seems like they're just trolling. <laughs> they're just throwing. Salty's run for no reason. It's exactly how I predicted earlier. The game's gonna be too easy. It's gonna get too easy. The players are gonna get bored and they're gonna start throwing for this is the this is maybe actually the hardest game. I think this is the hardest Pokemon game to do a friend lock in because it's so easy that the players all get bored and they start killing each other. Trust me, we ran the simulation. We had a computer up and everything. We used chat GPT I, to write out the uh, score. Uh, we, we did the math. I know. Oh, oh! oh yeah, man. I don't. Oh, no. dead. Jay's oh, dead. Okay. Jay's dead. Oh, Why did they? Oh, well, well, okay. Oh. I heard he's strong. I, I think he's stronger now. He <laughs> That's not how that works. That's he's not certainly... how that works. Editor's note. If perhaps you want an explanation as to why oh, yeah, yeah. Let's hear it. plan to do this very baffling battle strategy, yep. it's because there was no strategy. I have no idea why they decided to do this. I have no idea what their plan was here. <laughs> and to me, it just seems like they randomly fabricated a bunch of non-existent character lore last minute, specifically so they could try to kill That's each other so as a shitpost. These seemingly nonsensical actions would single-handedly cause a ripple effect that would change the course of our run going forward. Oh shit, here we go. What just happened that last turn? What is, what is Jay's Jay's ability is Wind Rider. Yep. No, that would have that would have helped any of this. Do anything. Oh, oh okay. Oh I didn't, my god. I didn't think Gerber. about that. Uh, you what, know. What so was even the bit? Hey, Gerber Cycle, you think you could do me a solid and hit that Mimikyu for me? Uh, are you gonna try to kill me? Um, no, I'm gonna try to kill the Mimikyu, but someone needs to hit it first. Are they gonna okay. use a uh, dragon my move for? Okay, I'll bite it then. Okay, good. Maybe you should have healed. I mean, I have a berry, so I, mean, I should break heal. the disguise is good. Whoever's the tank attack is thinking. Yep, nice. Bye. This, this was a very interesting turn of events. Nice. Yeah. Actual strategy. Way that you can put it, I guess. Can I? Uh, can I get switched out? Or he, it probably switched out actually, yeah, because the thing is uh, berry type. It's funny mm -hmm. how you think that I want to switch you out right now. <laughs> Who wants to swap in? Why is everyone holding like a useless item? Were the players allowed to choose their held items? <laughs> That's so funny. Incoming! Oh my god! That was good though. Ooh. Yeah. Oh my god! No! Oh. Oh, what? What the fuck? Just I looked away for one second. <laughs> I think we forgot that was part electric type. Yeah, that's uh. uh <laughs> we focused on poison. We were focused too much on poison. All right, we didn't think I have nothing to add to that. Uh, we're very self-reflected here. It sucks so much giving analysis for this goddamn game that I can actually give you to make you better as a Nuzlocker, which is the intention of this series, because. Every single fight of this game, the advice is you should have fucking used Skeleturge, because it's broken. <laughs> we made you that omelet. This is starting to get pretty scary, uh, huh? Not to completely ignore the thing that just happened, but can I kill the Toxtricity? Yeah, because it has... Please do that. Oh. A lot of stat boosts right now. This is going to do a fuck ton of damage to everyone. Oh, yeah. what, the, what the fuck? What the fuck? Wait, what did it, what did it what? use? It used Discharge, discharge. and it killed Are we going to get fully paralyzed here? Is this oh, running in a wipe? That makes no sense! Yeah! That shouldn't have been that effective! What the fuck? I mean, it no. did have a- Oh, oh my god, it fucking boosted itself Yep, last and time. you're fully oh parried. Oh I couldn't move, so, Oh my god! Uh, and it's gonna get the- Gerb Cycle this is can take so out spooky. the Toxtricity, because I think he outspeeds it. I heal so I don't get fucking killed. I'm gonna- Okay, whoever is playing as the, the Tinkaton knows their shit. Alright, they should- they should take over strategy from here. Okay, let's cross our fingers. Come on! Outspeed! Please! Please! Oh my god. Thanks. Okay, it's Shadow Sneak. Oh, thank Claire. god. So it's it Shadow me. Sneak 4.0. Out Outspeed. Wait, what? What? Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, I got a speed boost from the passive in this battle. 
<laughs> They're actually fucked. Do they wipe here? No fucking way. No way. No, 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 no. Yeah, Hex kills Tinkaton. Oh my god. Oh my when you god. at least get the damage off, right? But he's got boosted defenses too. Bite's not gonna kill. Oh my god. This is so bad. Oh my god. Okay, never mind. Right it's on low HP. Oh my god. Oh, Hex doubles attack if you have a status effect. He got fucking owned, man. Wait, that's me! <laughs> Drew! God, that guy's based. I purposefully got the shittiest, shittiest, cheapest box wine for the store for this because I never drink wine. And I thought it'd be funny to drink really bad wine, but this is, this is like the best wine I've ever had in my life. I don't know what the fuck is going on. Oh, he's dead. Okay. Get We're good. Oh We're my good. God. Oh my We're God. good. Let's take a breath. Oh my God. Gerber. Okay, listen, the other one was Jace. The, the Gerber. Jace one was I will say, I've been shitting on this game's difficulty a lot, but Rhyme is one of those fights where, I mean, specifically designed for this, right? Where if you don't have a really solid plan going in and you don't have all the broken mods that this game gives you, it can snowball out of control really quickly, which is what we saw. There's no way we're winning this shit. All right, so assessing the damage, we lost two really, really good Pokemon. Um, both Tinkaton and Garganacle are crazy strong. Um, we still have Cycles R. Shattail is still really, really, really good. Um, but the box is wearing a little thin, and I think the famous Nuzlocke Snowball that I talk about all the time, because uh, I only talk about like three things in these reactions ever, is starting to roll. Um, you lose some Pokemon, next fight gets harder, you lose some more Pokemon, and now the next fight is really hard, and you lose like half your shit, and then the Nuzlocke's basically over. I will let Nuzlocke experts break this battle down to see exactly <laughs> what went wrong. I, there's not much this, there's not much to say they decided to int literally actually in the original sense of the word int to intentionally feed they intentionally died on the worst fight possible to do so because it's the only fight where the enemy gets an advantage out of killing something <laughs> they couldn't have done, that's the only thing that went wrong my challenges please let me know if I'm wrong I will take an L on Twitter. I will take- You killed your teammate! What are you talking about? <laughs> Wait, why am I being called out here? What, what do you- You thought I would take your side in this? So does he- Is he like a master level ship poster? Or does he actually think that he had like a good plan there? What the fuck is going on? I got no f***ing clues. He got f***ing owned, man. That's right! I'm eating chicken right now. I can't. Anyone else feel kind of like hot? Yeah. No. That's right! <laughs> yeah. Hello, he's so big. Jesus yeah, Christ. He's, this thing is really powerful. This gentleman. Okay. Hello, little toddler. Super bulky. Does a lot of damage. Okay, it is entirely possible that we might actually lose this run. If that does happen, don't be sad. You know, it happens. It's sometimes Nuzlocke's we lose. And it's going to be a bit disappointing, but you know what? That's just a part of the journey. All right. It is. That's what makes it fun, man. We got Briska, Cookie, Luke, Forrest, Gerba Cycle 2, and Sarah. And before we get into it... I don't know if this is the only six Pokemon he has available, but drop that fucking Spide Ops. This thing is so... It is... By def... It, it has to be the worst option in this box. Because I know. Because it is the worst Pokemon in the game. If you have another Pokemon in your box, no matter what it is, I know it's better than Spide Ops. Okay, now we're cooking. Now we're cooking. Okay, we're so buying, like, hell items and shit. Lot. Okay, alright. Sell items. Whoa! Nice! Okay. Ooh. Yeah! Tad New cool. friend! And this is the final- Especially at this stage in the game, this is a very underwhelming Pokemon. Uh, no, actually Now come not. on, Peppy, let's have a fruitful battle. Okay. Alright, here we let's go. Do it. What kind of fruit? Man, this hard bikes. Yes. What the fuck? Cookie, get out of there! <laughs> Who's Mike and YZR? <laughs> cookie, no. Cookie, cookie, are... cookie, look at the screen. Oh. Look at the screen, cookie. Oh. Look, look at the screen. That's so God, funny. <laughs> look at the screen, look at the screen. Can we put this over Namona's Pokemon so Cookie can fight? <laughs> yeah, let's I see. can't believe you're actually My, my favorite is the pineapple. <laughs> Cookie, cookie, so, look at the screen. So, look at the screen. Oh, there it is. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. 
Uh, all right, oh, this sure? happened last time, but we're yeah. dragon type this time. Right. It's not that bad. That was close. Oh, uh, spaghetti. So I'm gonna dragon pulse. That's well, we deleted shed tail, which is like the best yeah, move in the game. <laughs> That's fine. Oh, okay. I will need to be here. Yeah. Yes, I'll, I'll heal you. Oh, his it, special attack is Are right. we are we really doing this again? <laughs> are we really gonna lose to this again? I, I guess like we weren't prepared to run into Mona, but fuck man. <laughs> At least when this can I don't know. <laughs> I guess we don't have a lot of Pokemon that deal with Torch Song, huh? It's a little spooky. Cause like the healing here is like not even that good, because you just give them more and more stat boosts every time. Uh, I'm with God is he just now. dead? Oh, oh nice. Oh. Oh. But he doesn't kill, right? Sorry. <laughs> Heal me, please, for you, back health. How many but, torch songs are there? Yeah, cause... Oh. oh, whoopsie! Just keep healing, <laughs> it's okay. You're gonna give him plus six! This is like the worst thing you could be doing! This entire time. Oh, I guess he... Oh, wait. I apologize. I was paying for nothing. He's using Snarl. Wait, but even if you snarl every other turn and then you heal, you're not snarling enough for the torch. Yeah, this doesn't work at all. <laughs> you really need a better plan for this. I honestly, if you just dragon clawed, because it wouldn't have two shot with plus one and a plus two, and I think dragon claw should three shot. I think you maybe made this a little bit too hard on yourself. <laughs> I'm, I'm thinking you turn into Luke and then Luke L Lumina crashes. Dude, no, because I, it, that's risking Luke. Luke is a sash. Oh, and his speed is high enough. That is true. Wait, you turn into Luke. You Thank turn you. into Luke, Luke <clears throat> Lumina crashes, Terroth led Lumina crashes. Okay, okay, are we good? Luke, are we okay with this? We're doing this, dog. Day one. This is this like Day plus one, two or only. plus three? You I mean, I think you take one. I think. Put me in, coach. Let's go, Luke. Let's go, My Luke. My heart hurts. Terastalized, Lumina Crash. Let's see if this works. Ooh. I think you're fine, right? Because you have the... That's fine. Yeah, because you got the Sash. Swap me out, dog. I don't think I have this. <laughs> no, you have this. You Easy. should be faster. You should be faster. It's not speeding up. Terastalized. Oh, yeah, this works. Terastalized, yes. You're good. Lumina Crash. Nice. Well played. Hey, Focus Sash coming in clutch. One, guys. It's been real. Luke, I love you. I don't want you to die. Luke, I, I believe. The skills. I believe. I come on, come on, outspeed. Yes! Yes! Please, please kill. Please kill. I believe. This kills. This can kill. This fucking animation is so stupid. <laughs> oh, no. Alright, Luke. Bye, Luke. Bye, Luke. We love you. Oh, oh my god. No. Unlucky. I'm gonna start crying on oh, oh. stream. Oh my god. I mean, now you just have to speed oh and kill, but. Oh my gosh! Fuck you, yeah. Skeletor! Oh my god. How does Gerb keep getting away with this shit, man? He's like. He's inting so much. He's made so many bad calls, and he always gets to survive these fucking fights. It's insane. It's not just these last two fights. The one Nimona fight before. <laughs> Gerb had terastalized out of his dragon typing, which was huge for, for that Skeletor dealing as much damage as it did. And two, I heard him say that he refuses to use Shed Tail. <laughs> I heard him say that shit. So a lot of those deaths are probably on his hand too, but he survives every one of these catastrophic battles while arguably causing the most damage in them. It's fucking insane. Luke, there's just nothing we could have done there. If you're watching this because we do these as an educational resource to you for, to learn from other people's mistakes, here we can clearly see <laughs> that was not a hard battle at all. The <laughs> Why is it me again? <laughs> but hey, this is an educational resource, okay? Actually, the re this is no longer an educational resource. The rest of this video is meant particularly to shit on everyone involved in this project and how bad they are at Nuzlocke's. That is the rest of the purpose of this video, all right? Let's, good luck. We're going in. Let's go. Okay. So, uh, sped ups. Sarah, Gerber. I mean, Buff Leech Life is a pretty good move, huh? Participating in this one. I'm just you're probably good at here. I, I think you're good started, here. Uh, you take this, you're like half up. HP. You're lost. Never mind, you, you got healed. You yeah, we're yeah, fine. Oh, Never mind. Oh, yeah. That's good. And that's how broken the Pokemon in this game are, and that's how easy it is, because even the worst Pokemon can do this. I'm not surprised. I feel like it's. <laughs> Brisk is just going to sweep here. <laughs> Get down, sir. Well, and anyway, we did it. Woo! I take everything back. Everything I said suck. about. All right.
Looks Spied like ops. our team. It might actually not be the worst Pokemon in the game, because I guess it does deal with one gym leader pretty well. Wait, I love every gender. <laughs> Yeah, That's go, honestly go, how this game has yeah, made me feel as well. This is a very accurate refle reflection of like how I feel person. about the characters in this game. The Pokemon are in their 30s. If you somehow die, that's on you. Oh, oh. 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 What? Oh, oh wait, no. Oh. Yeah, I changed my mind. Walk is the worst Pokemon in this game. Oh, oh that's bad, actually. Oh, my God. oh no, wait, that's not funny. It's fine. It's fine. No, it's fine. not. It's I can't heal him. Yep. If we can switch him out, we're switching him out. This is not gonna kill him. Not even close. Yeah. No, it's not. No, it's yeah, not. you're oh, fucked. No, no, no. Oh my god. Oh my you god. died of poison here? I think you died, right? Oh my god. Yep. Oh my god. What? <laughs> it was supposed to be a joke. It was supposed to be a joke. It wasn't supposed to actually happen. I mean, that's not a very He's impactful a death, to be fair. Where's the belt tied around you? The belt it's a necktie. Is... No, no, it's not oh. a necktie. It's around like the thin bit around like where my tail oh, like and the cheeks is. Oh, that's cute. That's yeah, around that little bulbous area. Up. Yeah. Wait, hold on. No, I've been charmed. It's around. I disagree with both like interpretations around, like... of how clots are would wear a tie. I think it would go like it's like under the. Neither of these make sense. Why would it be at the tail? It would be under. Like under the mouth here, and then go up here and go around. <laughs> That's the only one that makes sense. Why? <laughs> Never mind. Where? Our box is not looking great, huh? <laughs> Holy shit! We're a little bit fucked. Cyclozar are still really good, but Cyclozar are needs support from other Pokemon. Cyclozar is like the best support Pokemon ever created because it has like the best support move ever created. Yeah, but the rest looks a little meek. We lost a lot of good mons. This is going to be interesting. At this point, we were pretty much nearing some of the final challenges of the late game. However, I wanted to make sure to grind up the team a bit more off camera before we were completely ready to take all of that on. And also, Dude, <laughs> I'm sorry. Is... If you if you only take the script because most of this is just live stream footage. If you only take the scripted parts <laughs> that Salty has for this, every single thing is just like so. We just went grinding on the screen, <laughs> and then it's like stream footage for two hours. And then he's like, "Okay, before we did the next part, I made sure to grind up all my Pokemon." Is he looking for my approval or something? What's going on here? So, so that the comments don't get pissy with me again. Screw you, Oh, guys. it's so about the comments. Meantime, that makes more sense. We just sense. decided that we All were right. gonna actually have some fun for once. Yep, you know, true. just like fuck around and generally explore the region a bit more and get more familiar fuck with that. it. Because, <laughs> of course, everybody needs some uh, calm before the storm. Am I right? Let's begin. Is that foreshadowing? Okay, here we go, Forest. I guess spore. Okay, well, let's do something actual E4 right now, because the E4 in this game isn't free. Well, I guess you can switch, I think, no, you can't switch Pokemon from the box in between fights, I think. I don't remember. Either way, it's not free. It ha there's some s difficult stuff here. Toad Scroll is really good, though, especially for this fight. I think I've seen Toad Scroll solo this fight. I think we should be okay here. My terrestrialized Actually, I could be wrong. I could entirely be wrong about Toad Scroll being able to sweep this fight. I, dude, I don't fucking remember this game, man. This team is so garbage. <laughs> oh my god. I don't think they're making it through. Okay, I'm calling it right now. Right now in the video. I'm calling it right now. I think they're going to lose. Now I really am a land whale. I mean, this is pretty strong here. Oh my god! Yeah. This is all ground. It is all ground, but Clodsire has water absorb. So we'll keep that in mind for when Clodsire comes out. What what does Shed Tail do again? I switch out and gives a substitute. But I have regenerator, so I regain thirty three percent. So it's a free switch in no matter what. Oh, okay, that's that's great. Okay, yeah, let's. That's right, Gurb. You're controlling with the most broken Pokemon in this game. Second yeah, most. it's fine because it won't. Br it shouldn't break substitute. <laughs> it might break substitute. I think it's gonna break substitute. I think it'll you definitely break substitute. Force? Actually, I can go back in. depending on what happens with. But the you still got a free switch. You also... Do you see how broken Shed Tail is, by the way? <laughs> Do you see how good this fucking move is? For it, watch your step, because things are about to get a bit shaky. Uh, is it because of like an earthquake, maybe? Oh, okay, cool. Okay, it's not very effective. That was a free oh. switch. You might be able to just take a drain instead of. That was a free four. switch. I will suck it off. 
I think it's only Larry and the champion that are actually scary in this. The dragon one is... Wait, is there even a dragon? I don't fucking know, man. Go with my ass. What a fist this elephant. Zap cannon. Uh, let's open it. Uh -oh. It's all fine so far. All good it's plays. Everything's going oh great so far. My. Until you click zap cannon. That move is trash. Never click it. <laughs> so, like, I, I think you kill with discharge here, by the way. <laughs> like, I don't know. That's not really super good. Okay, discharge. Um, <laughs> nope. Okay, okay, okay. you're fine, you're fine. It's okay, guys. I'm squishy. I'm squishy. It's okay. You're so strong now. <laughs> Stupid thing yeah. allowed you to you charge. Yeah. Yeah. Who's good against Bronzong? It does have nothing that I am weak to. I mean, you have Crunch. Crunch would actually be super effective on it. Correct! <laughs> Was that the bite? Okay. She just sprays you in the eyes with Axe body spray. Wow. All right, all right. Right. Nice. <laughs> no, maybe Brady wow. that good with the goddamn sauce. I don't know. We're guys. cruising. I think we're going to be doing really good against all these challenges. We're cruising. That's, that's, that's it. That's it. My yeah, this Flamigo is a little bit scary. But I yeah. My second oh, I guess. Wage job. Are you ready to face? Now that I think about it, both. um, What the fuck is the name? Both the ice type and belly bolt are super good for Larry. And then you have the ice type for this. This should be free, right? Yeah, hassle. So I think it's only the champion that's going to give us problems. Hassle of the elite. Which is a very common theme. Um, but even... Even though I've seen a lot of people wipe the champion, and I think it's probably the hardest fight in the game, maybe second, it's still not that hard. <laughs> it's still a really easy champion. They literally get swept by one of the starters. <laughs> even took like Quagmire instead. But but I never for a moment imagined we, we would be facing each other so soon, giggity. How about a Kermit? Uh, now a teacher's duty is to Holy guide shit. students <laughs> and aid their growth. Can you do chills? But I think I shall forget about my role <laughs> as a teacher for a moment. Holy shit. Carl Weezer for the last one. I'm gonna beat your ass. <laughs> Watch, yummy. <laughs> Check this shit out, Jimmy. Very talented. I'm Terra Blast. Oh, Terra Blast. Okay. Guys, Ooh, we got fairy type terror blast on this and shit. Oh, we're oh, fine. Power. Why does Gerb get to be on the fucking elite four team for this, by the way? <laughs> and he gets to be like a, fa a fairy. He gets like the fairy type terror and everything. Holy shit! He's the the biggest sabotager I've ever seen on any run ever. The Onyx clip is nothing compared to what the damage this man has done to this Nuzlocke. I, I, this is just the impression stream. I've completely taken it over. <laughs> True. <laughs> you fucking lost your mind. Dude, how easy... I'm sorry, this entire reaction is just me shitting on how easy Scarlet Violet are. It's just... It's nice to come back a year later after this game and see... <laughs> That nothing has changed. That even these fucking stop. idiots can There's breeze no through the game. No one else. Absolutely crazy. Alright, yeah, show us how you fuck up on this fight. Let's see it. Let's see it. You've built it up. You did the foreshadowing. Let's see what you fuck up. Come on. Welcome. It's Gita. That's why they call her Top G. Oh. Sucker Punch only hits if it uses a physical move, puppy. Oh, okay. You might just want to use Discharge. Yeah, yeah, time. okay. Let's do Discharge. But what, what is what, what is going on here? What is this tampering? <laughs> They're supposed to pick their moves. You're just telling them what to pick now. <laughs> What's going on here? Oh. Okay. Uh, oh, this the thing. Oh well, you got charged up. That's good. Okay. Okay. Well, never mind. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Belly bolt <laughs> does do a first. lot of damage. Okay. Oh boy. Okay. Yeah, you're good. fine here. This is all good so far. Yeah, baby. Okay. There's all good so far. Zero way that we can lose this now. Right. <laughs> That's what I'm thinking. Should. This fight do is easy mode. And if it's okay, then Terra. No Terra for like no, the worst champion ever. All because of uh, the grass type. Kill it, forest. Light work. No reaction. Forrest, do you have anything to say about sweeping? Anything to say? Anything to say at all, Forrest? All right, awesome. <laughs> You're Forrest Toad School. We have to know. Nardwar? Nardwar, what are you doing? You are. <laughs> you are Peppy's team. We have to be here. Congratulations! It's my honor to call you Champion Peppy. It is now your duty to. What send was the foreshadowing for? The trainers and you baited me. So just don't get canceled on Twitter or anything like that, please. Racial slurs. <laughs> <laughs> that was the most nothing Elite Four of all. Nothing, fucking nothing happened. What am I supposed to say here? Yeah, fucking Belly Bolt's ability is pretty fucking good. Mm. Oh, wow, you got an Ice type, and there's a Flying type die, and there's a Dragon type. Oh, wow, Ice Spinner does 
Make it pretty quick, makes it pretty fast. Wow. And this final challenge that was crazy. Is not that hard. Yeah. What? It really isn't, is it? This. Break it with he's not terrid. Alright. Have they learned to deal with the Skeleturge? Okay, oh. No, we messed up. We messed I... up. Well, I'll use a full restore. How have Just you still not a powerful fire type move? Hey, hey, Skeleturge. Is the third time. Do that. Oh my god. It's the I third time. Too much from thick fat. Goodbye, everyone. It's been a nice run. Oh, wait, are you shadow? Oh, you shadow. Why did it do that? <laughs> Terra liquidation. Isn't Nimona supposed to be like a champion? Never mind. <laughs> All you have to do is just survive this one attack cookie, okay? I'm pretty sure it's going to use its yeah, signature no. move. No, they still haven't learned from the torch like song thing, nothing. but it doesn't even matter. Okay. The game doesn't even punish yeah, them for that. Wow, <laughs> it's so really stupid. Oh she actually threw. <laughs> Do it again. Fuck it. I think I can survive. Uh, actually, you might not. Oh, I'm dead. No, you're I'm fine. Not. Oh, okay. Wow. Okay. Uh, so we might have gotten slightly too cocky, actually. Yeah. It didn't exactly throw. <laughs> oh my god. I mean, no! you're fine. Draco, me. You're so fine. Herbert, please hit. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Never punished, by the way. Ooh. Drake Dragon Claw kills that there 100%. The fucking crocodile. I'll, I'll switch in a Gerb cycle. Whatever you do. I'm gonna say before this, I've never seen anyone lose to any of these fights. <laughs> Dude, don't die. All right. This I shit. The all of these fights are so this. goddamn free. Gyarados. <laughs> it does have earthquake. I learned now. Uh, oh. But uh, wait. Huh? Hold up. Hot take? Oh, I'm not sure what Belly Ball's defense stat is. If I had to guess, you live in EQ here. I think you can just click discharge. You're you're probably dead to crit, but I try. I think that we should switch to forest just because if it uses play. earthquake, forest will live regardless. If you want to play around the crit, I think you go to forest. You're not killing it super fast. Gyarados special defense is not bad. Wrong. Oh my god. Oh my god. No. Oh my god. You only no. get one guaranteed speed turn. No, you live no, this, no, right? No. Yeah. Oh, okay. Easy. Oh my god. It's fine. I it's called fine. it. No, let's go. Although, oh no, God. hold on. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. It's okay, guys. I got this. That was a valid concern, but apparently. Stop. I don't get credit for that. I said you you would live, but you would be dead to crit. It's not even close. But I did also say I didn't know Belly Bull's defense stat, so. I Basically, I skipped until I saw they were talking about me again. If Pokemon challenges were here. I'm here right now. What's up? Jan would say, keep Shed Tail. It's super cool. Yep. It's super awesome. Yep. Also, Salty, you're looking really handsome today. You Let's are. Let's go. Oh, I get, I get I'm so glad. You knew exactly what I was going to say. That's crazy. If you try to stop the time machine, I will most likely attack you. So am I not... I mean, yeah, this is probably the hardest fight in the game, right? Although I will say, I say it's the hardest fight in the game. I don't think I've ever seen anyone wipe here. I think everyone I've seen get to this point actually does it. All right, Ken Bagel X. It's time for do or Okay, die. what's the plan here? Let's go. Place your bets. Tick tock. Tick this is a little tock. bit scary. Yeah. Yeah, okay, here we go. Let's see. Why, why, why are we, what are we doing? Are you kidding me? Oh, yeah. Why are we are using you? metronome <laughs> on the final fight of the game? That honestly did more damage than I thought. Why are we throwing? I gave you a hyper potion. That was hilarious. I'm just giving him more fire, fire dances, right? Can the crit I into the I nice, wanna, nice. I don't want to tell you what to do, but it is raising its stats, uh, and yeah. uh, the joke was funny for two seconds, and now we're screwed. Yep. <laughs> Tick tock. Ken, you're not. Oh, it only it. has metronome. Oh my god. Oh, no. <laughs> Why does it feel such crap? Make your choices no. count. What were the odds of that? What? Okay, so we basically. Went minus one Pokemon and gave this like plus three. <laughs> this is also on Salty for healing this, by the way, for no fucking reason. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Well, it, it's powering up, so like we need to kill it in like two moves, uh, like mm -hmm. fast. Yeah. You ready? Okay. Okay. Hopefully this doesn't kill. It's, it's gonna do a lot of damage. Oh my god. Owie. 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 Oh, and it's, it's. Dude, if they lose to this, how the what the fuck am I supposed to say? How, how what am I supposed to analyze? What am I supposed? Yo, yeah, you shouldn't have fucking used metronome for fucking five turns in a row while he's set up on you. It's crazy. They better fucking win this. I swear to okay, God. Okay. Nice, nice, nice. Nice, nice, pasty. That's my big man. 
Uh, we're just gonna close combat. They right have pretty good the Pokemon for this, to right be honest. I just, I, like, this I is fine. Let's go! Wow, oh my god! Mm. Chicken, my favorite. It's ice water. Ice water? Oh. So, mm -hmm. you should be good. Yeah, he Please just discharge. Okay, okay, we're good. Dude, Belly Bolt is so and bulky. Charged up. And it does a lot of damage, too. I've underrated Discharge. this Pokemon a lot. Nice. This is actually pretty bye crazy. Bye. <laughs> Look yeah, at this that's right. Yeah, that's that. Yeah, damn, that's crazy. They win. Wow, that's uh -huh. amazing. Poison jab them. Okay, Why? That probably would have been better for the first time. <laughs> Why did they no, earthquake? We we <gasps> no, you're fine. Oh my! Oh my! Oh my! Oh my! Oh my God! Oh my! We did it! 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 We like Fortnite. We wow! Congrats, guys! I'm so proud of you for beating the baby game for babies. God. Yeah. That was so that was... stressful. <gasps> Guys, let's get a thousand likes on this video. <laughs> Goodbye. Fuck it. There he goes. <laughs> uh huh. Damn, their turnaround is almost as fast as mine. <laughs> what the fuck is happening? <laughs> this is so stupid. <laughs> Enjoy your future. It's gonna be great. <laughs> Oh, this is the this is the best part of any season, is the anime outro. This is the only thing I care about. Anyway, guys, yeah, that was fucking great. Um, so what did we learn? Uh, fuck Salty for baiting us into thinking that anything interesting would happen after any of these fights, or that any of the fucking fights would matter. Fuck Gerber, or whatever the fuck his name is, um, for literally inting the entire time and still being on every winning team ever. Um, fuck, uh... Whoever made this game, it's awful, it's really easy, it doesn't work, and uh, nuzlocking it means just getting one of like 17 different super overpowered Pokemon sweeping. Um, and thank you guys so much for a lovely 2023. If this is the last video of the year, I'm not sure if it will be. Um, thank you for an awesome year, I appreciate it. Uh, there's really big things coming for next year. Um, look out for my first upload of January, it's gonna be a huge announcement. Thank you for watching. Thank you, Genuinely Salty, for making this series. It's fun every single year, and I can't wait to sit here in exactly a year and do this exactly again. It's the best Nuzlocke content on YouTube. Thank you so much for watching, and goodbye.